All right. Questions for Carl, just to sort of try and tap into his brain, see what's going on there. Yeah. The uh, questionnaire that is often featured at the end of the TV programme inside the actor's studio. If heaven exists, what would you like to hear God say when you arrive at the pearly gates? Is that how it works? Oh. oh no, what I'm, do you mean? What's the question? Well, I don't know. Uh, do you hear so many other things that you have to go through other gates? I can't imagine him being on the door, is what I'm saying. <laughs> if he owns a place, what's he doing there? He could put well, anyone on it. It's St Peter, isn't it, who's normally minding the gates, famously. Right, so it's him asking me. OK, well, let's say it's St no, Peter. No, 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 you go through the gate, Peter goes, oh, you're expected, um, he's got an appointment, we're going through to God, go through a few doors, go up top floor, right, past the executive washroom, into his big office, OK, that overlooks the universe. So what, what? So you've gone in to see God, it's an audience with God, you've died, you've gone to heaven, mm. and what would you like God to say to you at that point? Um, probably just, just say, oh, um, you've done well in that in your life. You never did anybody any harm. So, welcome to the, to heaven. Any problems, give us a shout. Um, you know, here's a little layout of, of like a, you know, like a little map. It's kind of like... I love this. This is a great answer. And my favourite one is you never did anyone any harm. That's, that's great. That's a brilliant thing for God to say. Yeah. So, hang on, he's giving you a little map. So, he's giving you a little map of the a area. It's big. He'll sort of say, this is where you go for this, this is where you go for that. Um, I'd, I'd probably ask him about the ghost situation. I'd say, am I now a ghost then? Or is this just like another pl planet that I've come onto? Right. Uh, I don't know if he'd answer that. I don't know if he'd be sort of a bit... A bit cagey. Yeah, a little bit like, well, I don't want to panic you and stuff. Um, I'd say, right, is it right that I can see past family and that? Because, to be honest, I'd probably prefer to stay away. <laughs> No, but oh, because the thing is, if you've done all, I've done all that in this life, so it's about moving on to another life and meeting different people, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Otherwise, what's the point? It's just yeah. like the same all over again, but everywhere's white. I mean, I don't know if it is like. Do you this. think I'm God just... would like this podcast? Um. Uh, well, I suppose it just kills half an hour, doesn't it? Well, yeah, but time's not a problem for him, is it? Yeah, it is because he lives for ages, so he needs loads of filler. I bet he's, you know, doing stuff that is just like I'm not really into this, but it's something to do, isn't it? <laughs> Sudoku and stuff. <laughs> But I think there'll be just as many problems up there as there is here, because at least people are leaving here, whereas up there, that's the thing that I'd be worried about the most, actually, that it's really crowded. Because <laughs> it's years and years of dead people, isn't it? <laughs> London does me head in. Up there, it's going to be well busier than that. <laughs>